Hi, this is Turka Prasad and my register number is UR15CS220. Today I am going to develop a C++ program that uses the structure of an employee to store the employee details like name, designation and salary. And I am going to use functions to get the details of employee and I uh, also have to print display the salary according to their designation. And then finally I have to print these type of uh, values in the output screen. So let's see if this program here hash include ever stream is the header file and then using namespace std is the standard function. Struct employee. So I am declaring an employee structure uh, with the name employee and then these four are the uh, structure members. These are name, ID, designation and salary. Name and designation are of character data type and the ID and the salary is are of int data type. Sorry, ID is of int data type and salary is of floater data type. And then from here int main is the main function and then I am declaring struct employee s of 30. So the maximum number is 30. Up to 30 people's details it can store in that program. We can store it in we can take in this program and then and I am also declaring int i see out enter the details of the employee so for that i am using for loop i equal to 0 is the initialization and i less than 2 is condition and i plus 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 i is the uh, pre increment operator so as i am using i here i declared it in the into data type and then s of i if i am taking first in the first step i equal to 0 so s of i will be s of 0 and then the see out for example name s of i dot name maybe it, so it will take as s of 0 dot name and then the name will be it will ask to enter the name and then scene statement is used to take that name and then in the same way for example id also for employee id also it will ask to enter the id and then it will take it as s of i dot id and then for employee designation it will ask to enter the employee designation by using cf statement and then cn statement is used to take that si designation in the same way it will ask and take the uh, employee salary using cn statement by si dot salary and then here uh, so if it is completed then it will go to the top position again and then from here it will start as i value will be increased by one and then i value will become one here so i will one is less than two and then plus plus one so it will a uh, value will be increased by two so s of two will be taken here uh, in the same first also i will equal to zero and then i less than equal to so zero is less than already two so it will go to the next position that is plus plus i so its value increased by one so s of one will be taken here and then so as I am entering 2 is the maximum number uh, so only 2 people IDs can be entered here and then those values have to be printed so that I am using this for loop to print the details and then see out and L information for employee and see out and L name uh, s of i dot name and then s of i dot id and s of i designation s of i salary these 4 c out statements are used to print the names of an employee uh, details of an employee by using this for loop in the same uh, in that first step again uh, i equal to 0 so it will go to the next position so 0 is less than 2 so it will go to the next position and its value will be increased by 1 and so s1 details will be taken and then after this position it will go again here and then one will, uh, so he, now i equal to 1 here and then it will go 1 is already less than 2 and then it will go to the next position that is plus plus i so its value will be increased by 1 so uh, 2 then s2 value will be taken yes if 2 come here means 2 equal i equal to 2 and then 2 is not less than 2 so it will break here and the return statement will be called so let's check whether the program works or not successfully compiled and it is asking for me to enter the details so i'm entering them as uh, name as richard and then it is asking to enter the employee id that is 1009 i am entering this id and then for example uh, it is asking employee designation so i am uh, i am designation is manager and then salary is 80 8 lakhs 90 thousand so again it will ask for second uh, employee's details so i am entering the test 
name as Ann and then employee ID is 1045 and then designation is uh, HOD and then employee salary is 5,50,000 so the details have been successfully printed according to this uh, name ID designation salary and in the same way name ID designation salary and finally a statement is being followed so thank you